Those vegan guys. Oh, thank you. Hello, if you're new to the channel, I'm Paul. I'm Jason. And together we are Those, Those Vegan, vegan guys. guys. And before we start the video, can we please ask you to give the uh, video a thumbs up if you like it at the end, but consider subscribing. Very important to all YouTubers, and we would love you to join us uh, on our channel here, which is growing exponentially. Exponentially. So, we did a poll. A poll. A poll. We like to do a poll now and again, and we asked, we had three choices on this one. Tesca. Morrison's and Arsland and if you tallied all the votes up on Facebook and YouTube Morrison's just pipped it just at the post but don't worry we do shopping vlogs all the way through Veganuary we try to hit all the major supermarkets so Tesco will be coming yeah yeah probably next weekend we've got time before the end of January just like we've got time to hit 10k subscribers it, it can amazing. happen it could happen in january <laughs> <laughs> so morrison's won uh we're gonna go in there see what they're offering for the january um if you're interested in shopping vlogs do check out our shopping vlogs playlist there we've as i said we've done all the major supermarkets and the one before this one we did wing yip chinese supermarket it's kind of fabulous we shopped there semi-regularly shall we go in let's go and see morrison's please don't disappoint us Mozzers, you best make me smile <sighs> with me no teeth Oh, I know. Have you seen that? You can have it. Right here. <laughs> Maybe not. So obviously, it must be said, the most important section in any supermarket for us vegans is fruit and veg. And it's a fantastically big section here at Morrison's. Uh, but we're not going to show you carrots. You know where they are. There is... The chilled section here, with the spray cream, two pound. The Oatly creme fraiche, 155. Oatly new yogurts, two pound. The coconut, uh, yeah, the coconut collaborative, chocolate little pots, and the uh, banoffee pots are two pound. They are stunning. We have them in regularly. They've got all the gur, gur, free from for two pound at the moment. Yeah. Oh, Jay. Yeah. If you've never tried this, please believe me when I say if you like lemon, try it. It's outstanding. That's going in there. Lots of gosh stuff. And some Kirsty stuff. Are they vegan? Just that one. Vegan friendly. Yeah. And that's three pound. Now, many Morrisons have a pizza stand like this. We've never actually featured it before, or even looked at it. But we've just Jason's has just pointed out there is a vegan. There's a vegan recipe cheese there. So you can actually get a vegan pizza here, which is pretty fantastic. You know, it's funny if you check out our last, um, if you check out our last Morrison's vlog, this section was decimated then, and it's exactly the same now. But there is uh, quite a plethora of tofu. Got the. Um, the V bacon, V deli rushes. Oh, and they've started doing their own uh, ham, sage and onion. Look at this corn vegan ham's a pound at the moment. So you know there's two in my trolley. That's cute. What is it? Antipasti, platter. 
how much is it? It's like two pound fifty. Cute though. But it is cute, and those tomatoes look stunning. Yeah. You yeah. could do it yourself, couldn't you? If you wanted to. Yeah. But... Um. So look, no chicken Kievs. How much are they? They're not very good with lining up the prices <laughs> here, are they? No. Uh, beefless steaks, chorizo style sausages, Cumberland style sausages, thick cut vegan rashers, £2.50, and no chicken strips, £2.50. Well, we would normally try a Kiev, Jason. So I'm willing to give that a shot. Well, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? Genuinely. And I'm quite, I'm quite eager to try this, um, this bacon as well, to be honest. So I'm gonna get both. And if you don't like it, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> So priced between um, the three bean one, I think is one pound sixty from it's down there. But all of these are marked vegan. These four, right here. A lot of people have been talking about these donuts lately, particularly the salted caramel ones. And um, we think it's an ingredient thing, but some of them might be vegan. The only warning on there is soya and wheat. Uh, and a lot of the vegan groups have been raving about them and eating them. So there you go. Okay, we have an apology to make to Morrison's. We weren't looking right. We've just found actually that I've turned one bottle round for everyone that's marked vegan. So that you can see where it says vegan. Right there. Vegan. 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 And, Jay, I'm gonna get one of these, you know. I know it's a tenner, but the bottle's beautiful. It's such a lush. And I can... It's gorgeous, <laughs> it is. I can reuse that bottle for something. The reason we've been remiss is because most of these are way out of our price. Yeah, we, we like don't normally However, spend any more than a fiver. Two for a tenner. Yeah. This one's vegan as well. Oh, hang on a minute. I'm sure I saw the vegan sign on that. Ignore me, I'm an idiot. Ignore him, he's an idiot. Yeah, you've got to check your labels here carefully. Uh, and sometimes it's really big, like that, which is fabulous and sometimes it's really, really, really tiny on the back of the bottle like that. But it's worth having a look, guys. Check out your wines at your local Mozzies. And just because we know not everyone is a red wine drinker, they do have white wines as well, clearly marked vegan. Oh, and that one. And then maybe more. Yeah, so check them out, guys. Like Jason just said, we're not looking, we're not your man. <laughs> we did wonder whether they'd have any sort kind of veganuary sections, and they do. They've got this little section here. We've never seen any of these things before. Uh, so they've got, they're all two pound, all of them. They've got southern fried wings. Chicken satay, chicken ticker, chicken popcorn, and chicken pakora. Oh, and steak with spice crust. Well, how interesting is that? Two quid, yeah, be rude not to. And on the other side of this little freezer here, they've got uh, all this for £2, which is the green cuisine stuff. The uh, the nuggets, 
the dippers, the burgers and the sausages. I wanted to get these but Jason's taught me out of it because of because of all the red. Look at the red. Look at it. But they do have these if you fancy a treat. And they're two for three pound right now. Look at his judging eyes. Oh look, they've got an offer on uh, Alpro milks at the moment for one pound twenty. And if you've never had that one, the dark chocolate almond milk. Make a bowl of porridge with it. Thank me tomorrow. You don't have to thank me. I mean, we are just repeating ourselves here now because uh, we covered all this stuff in our last Morrison's vlog just before Christmas. So I'm going to link that one specifically up there now. Uh, but all of this stuff was here then. And we're here really to cover special stuff for the January. But they do have this nice chilled uh, section. Uh, and of course they've got all the same milks unchilled as well, just so as you know. Doing well on vegan males here, they've got their own one, Hellman's. And uh, yeah, I think I'm just looking underneath, everything else is not vegan. But there you go, marvellous. Jay reckons that Morrison's have got it nailed when it comes to the uh, frozen section which is here and it's quite long and they have I mean it's fair to say and all their vegan stuff is clearly marked vegan it all looks like this it's all got the V-Taste symbol on it so we've got burgers 175 Indian style quarter pounders Vegetable quarter pounders, meat free sausages, sweet potato nut cutlets, katsu curry melts, no lamb kebabs, little um, no chicken pops, also 175. Cauliflower popcorn, a pound. Oh, they've got all sorts, haven't they? And then they've got the uh, the best of range next door. Yeah, I'm going to get up there, Jay. Nice one. I think they're veggie. Yeah, I think that's just vegetarian. And then, that's all vegan. And all this stuff here is the best. Layered vegetable tarts, creamy mushroom wellingtons, nut roasts, ultimate meat free burgers, six ounces, all the fantastic uh, corn fishless fillets. And then we get on to um, all the stuff we've just shown you, the zingers and all these new bits. Oh, bar barbecue uh, jackfruit parcels, Jay. Mm. Of course, our fabulous friends, Naughty Vegan. Oh, yes, some of that. Get some of those sausage rolls, Jay. We've got no sausage rolls in and I do like theirs. Yeah, nice. And then down here, Naked Glory. Some fries products. It's such a shame that they don't sell the fries slicing sausage in here anymore. Used to be one of the only places you could get it and it's brilliant. And then, Linda McCartney. Green Cuisine. The vegan pizzas, of course. Good fellas. And more Linda McCartney. Ignore them, they've got cheese in.
pretty good. It's a pretty good range of frozen stuff. Get yourself down to Morrison's, kids. Have a right good look. Well, I don't think we're buying much more, but we have decided to get quite a few bits. And you know why, don't you, Beryl? Because it'd be bloody rude not to. That's why. You know, if you don't, uh, if you don't get a chance to use a lot of fresh vegetables, you can't go wrong with stuff like this. And look, they've even marked it vegan for you, so you know, so you know. <laughs> Sprouts and carrots and lots of fabulous frozen vegetables. Do you know what, though? These are a lifesaver for some people, aren't yeah. they? And. Cheaper than if you buy them fresh half the time. Yeah. Because you get a lot more in them. We've said, haven't we? We think some stuff translates over and is fine from frozen. Other stuff does suffer a little bit texturally. Yes, definitely. I came thinking he knows stuff. I know stuff. Have they got any vegan ice creams? Uh, top end here. All right, we'll have a look there. Oh, just roll. Always vegan. Apart from the full butter, anything that says full butter is not. But it's one of the only places you can get Volavant cases, and who don't love them? Oh, yeah. There we go. Is that garlic pizza bread uh, vegan, Jason? I don't think so. They are, though. Morrison's own brand. £2. We've just noticed these in the freezer section as well. Lightly salted potato wedges, garlic and herb potato wedges, seasoned curly fries, and potato lattices. Are they marked vegan, Jason? Because everything else is. Oh, well pointed out, out yes. Uh, I know the battered onion rings are next door. Oh, well, we need some of them because we've run out. As you'll know, we do love an onion ring. Vegan. Pound. And those things I just showed you, by the way, they're all a pound. Isn't that good? Interject. Cush cam. They are, it's just tiny. Oh, yeah. See it there. That's the lat potato lattices. Yeah. No, yeah, they're pretty good though, aren't they? You know. And? Right, we're off out of here. We're done. We're bloody done. Oh. Well, that was us, Sean, wasn't it? A little bit. Thank you to whoever it was. I think it was on our Facebook page. Said if you're going to go to Morrison's, have a look at the wine. Yes. Uh, because there are some vegans. So thank you to you. You showed us a couple of pictures of white wine bottles. And when we looked, there were indeed more wines. Yeah. Um, but, like we said in there, just slightly out of our price range for just general having a glass of wine with an evening meal. Yeah. You know, we tend to go for the £5 and under. And I know people would frown at that, but them are people with much deeper pockets than we've got. Yeah. <laughs> All of that. It's so true. It's so true. Because it's like we have got used to, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with a sub four quid bottle of wine from Aldi, as we've proven in previous vlogs. Some of them are absolutely gorgeous, but we did get that bottle of um, Chianti for a tenner, uh, which we're going to have on our live mukbang tonight, Saturday night, as we're, we're filming this now. Um, I'll link our mukbang up there, because we're having a um, Lily's vegetarian, vegan, uh, Indian spread. Very excited about it. Yeah, very excited about that tonight. But they've got some nice, good new stuff in Morrison's that I didn't expect. Yeah. Um, and all that fro all that frozen stuff we've got. Mm -hmm. um, Two quid each. We love stuff like that in wraps, you see, with a nice salad. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and we've eaten meat alternatives for the last seven years, and I doubt we'll ever stop, which is why I always say we will never be whole food plant-based. Mm -hmm. But we do love whole food plant-based meals and incorporate them into our... Yeah. But there's nothing wrong with having stuff like this, and don't let anybody ever guilt you out about that. Oh, why are you having a lot of alternatives? Because I like them, Karen, and they cause no death. How about that? 
It's all about moderation. It As is. we've said before, for the majority of people, it's about moderation. What I was also encouraged by, I mean, we won't know for definite until we open them, but um, they were all two quid. They all look really, really tasty. Mm -hmm. um, they're great, as Paul said, in terms of having with something else. Salad or veg or... Yeah, and, um, you know, the packaging is all recyclable because it's cardboard. cardboard. So, it's, yeah. a, it's wins all round for Morrisons. I still don't think the the the, the top of the uh, the top of the chart when it comes to supermarkets and vegans we, we love sainsbury's yeah uh, but even sainsbury's fall down when it comes to cleaning products and personal products because so m m there's hardly anything marked vegan and cruelty free mm -hmm. the co-op wins when it comes to but we're going off on a tangent strengths and weaknesses everywhere this is about morrison's we hope you've enjoyed it we certainly enjoyed making it for you we hope you find it helpful we would love a thumbs up we would love a sub as we said at the start and uh, thank you for watching us yeah all that love you Mister. love you mm -hmm. love you guys we'll see you again very soon and until then please be excellent to yourselves and each other Bye, loves. Hey, Morrison, she showed us up.